Being a Polynesian dancer requires precision, speed, and attention to detail. I'm stubborn as hell, and I'm not gonna lose to any bear or to anybody on this competition. This is Man vs. Bear. Humans, welcome to Bear Mountain, Utah. I'm Brandon Tierney. All right, Alpha, tell us about yourself. Well, I'm a Polynesian performer. It's a lot of training, lots of running, lots of cardio, lots of squats. Hey, look at those thighs, yeah. man. His thighs are as big as my torso. It's a lot of work to get them legs, but uh, yeah, the legs, you gotta have legs. <laughs> are you gonna tap into any of your Polynesian dance moves? It's all body language. Give us a little sample. Just, oh, you a, just a little that? taste. Yeah, what do you got? Scare me. Just to get me going. <laughs> Your first challenge is called King of the Mountain. Your pulling strength is about to be put to the ultimate test. You will go head to head with Bart. A 1,400-pound grizzly bear whose sole job is pulling you off the platform, pulling you into a 22-foot free fall into the water below. Alpha, you're up first. Here at King of the Mountain, I'm gonna do what I do best. I'm gonna plant my feet into that ground, pull that rope with all my strength and put my heart into it, and then I'm gonna give this bear a taste of my mana. Alpha, he's here to win. Alpha's confident, no doubt. Confidence can serve you well out in the wild. A big presence can intimidate predators. There he is. There he goes. Bart is the largest grizzly on Bear Mountain. With a standing height of eight and a half feet, he is absolutely massive. Ah, Alpha may feel ready for this, but it'll take every skill in his arsenal to share the season high with Bruce. Here we go. All right. Bart jumps on the rope. Alpha goes deep into a squat, using his massive legs for leverage. Bart's taking on the challenge. This is no challenge at all. Alpha goes down. Backwards, flip out the lights. Party's over. Alpha's wet. Justin got dragged off the platform like a tin can attached to a car. You got me on this one, Bart. But brother, I got a lot more spirit in me now. Still more to go, bro. Let's go. Bring it up. Up next is Brute Force. In third, Afa trying to get it going here. You know, really, since we first met Afa, all he's done is project confidence. Being a Polynesian dancer, of course he's in superb condition. Great spirit. Brute force will not be difficult for me because I'm used to flipping my big 600 pound tire back at home. Once I get that momentum going, game over. Here we go. Ah. Oh yeah, he's oh, up on it now. We're going double paw. Look at his shoe, his toe is sticking out. He's trying the shoulder approach now. Different tactic here by Alpha. Alpha taking advantage, and I think he might have a lead here. He does! Three points! And he's closing it on the four-point mark. Alpha down on the dirt, shoulder shoves, there's four points. That is a new season high. Getting close. Can he get it to the post? Oh, he's got it! And Bart is off the log. For the first time ever, Bart goes down. Victory for Alpha. Brute force, Alpha conquers it. You know, that was... A challenge on this gravel. I got my Sunday best shoes now. They're holy. <laughs> and I got my knees all busted up. <laughs> but my pride is still here, my brother. Thank you, Bart. <laughs> Alpha, tremendous progress throughout. You kind of felt your way in, and then you started to really dominate. Sometimes you just need that little intimidation from an apex predator such as Bart to kind of wake your soul up and be like, yo, you alive? So it was fuel. Oh, bro, it was fuel for the system, man. Woo! -hoo. Here we go. This is big time. The humans have one last shot to earn a spot at human prey. It's Grizzly Heights. They battle through an obstacle course, climb a tree, and try to ring the bell before time expires. 
so as Hoffa gets ready to head over to the starting point, I'll tell you what, I think he will flourish here. Explosive, great dexterity. He can add to his resume by becoming the first challenger to ring the bell. This challenge is gonna require a lot of speed, a lot of focus, and I just gotta make sure I don't trip over these holy shoes, that's it. <laughs> Clock is set at 37 seconds. Afa needs to put it all together here to take down Ramonte. <laughs> Huge <laughs> leap over the first log. Afa <laughs> quick up over log two, looking like an Olympic hurdler. Off is at the screen, immediately up to the two-point line. He is moving. Legs and orbs in sync, three points, and he's now tied with Ramonte. Ten seconds to go, and he's making a run at the bell. One more point, and he takes the last spot in the final. There it is, four points. Can he be the first human to max out at Grizzly Heights? No, no. Time expires just before he rings the bell. Man, that was close. What a run. Afa will join Justin for the final battle at Human Prey. Justin, Afa, congratulations. But it only gets tougher from here. You'll be taking on Bart the Bear at our final challenge, Human Prey. You will be going face to face with Bart, and the only thing separating you from Bart is a thin layer of steel. The second Bart makes contact with the ball, the battle is on. <laughs> Bart will smash into you, blow by blow, until you land in the crater below. Your goal? Stand your ground and fight back. We're back at Bear Mountain for Afa's turn at Human Prey. This is it. I'm holding on to this ball for dear life. Have at it. Afa, the war cries echoing across Bear Mountain right now. He's fired up. He's ready to go. And here comes Bart. <laughs> Come on. Stretching his limbs like a starfish, he's reached to the top of the cage to balance his weight. Bart's pummeling in the cage. Alpha can't stop the momentum. He's going down. There it is. He's down. Woo! Oh, Absolutely devastating for Alpha. Just seven seconds away from taking the win from Justin. Man, what a battle. Justin, Afa, great fight. Afa, you battled Bart for 18 seconds. We loved watching you compete, but here on Man vs. Bear, the bear won. It's time to leave the mountain. Come on, man. Really? Thank you. Damn, one under. Oh, my god. One point under. I may have come up short today, but I came here and I accomplished my goal to be an inspiration for my family, for my kids, and for my Polynesian peoples. One love. <laughs>